I always was a bit unsure about whether I was ready for kids. Oh my god. It's happening. I was like drunk beyond my mind. Why did this have to be in right now? It's a husband's job, right? To be there for your wife. I was like, f*** it, like, f***ed up that whole thing. What's it like to be a father? To be... This is your daily catch-up. <laughs> no, we're gonna reshoot. We're gonna use this one. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll use this one. Boom. Uh, John is late, so I have to do this quickly. More than 50% of you are still not subscribed. Please go down below and click the subscribe button. Thank you very much. On to the episode. Protection is off, and then it's a father, and then it's a mother! <laughs> yeah. Yeah. To be, 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 to Damper anything, but there's still quite a lot of risk, and so yeah, like yeah, yeah. it's yeah. like it's it's so but hard. But let's to not be go there. But let's not go there. Okay, okay. Yeah, let's yeah. do a proper introduction. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so the last time you saw Ned on the show, she was only girlfriend. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's yeah. true. Yeah. Fiance, yeah. but now yeah. then we're gonna introduce been promoted. Why? That's my baby mama. <laughs> <laughs> American of you <laughs> and my wife. So <laughs> welcome back to the show, Net. Hey. Hey. Net so used to be a account director in Gravity, so this is hey. a double reunion. Woo. True. And so for those of you who don't know yet and are not following Dan on Instagram, he has recently announced that he has become a father. How did you find out? Oh my goodness. So uh, what I didn't know, right, was that she was- Pregnant. She secretly, <laughs> she secretly tested herself. Like, yeah, why times. do girls do that? All my girlfriends do that. Like. All, your, all your girlfriends? All of them. All my wives <laughs> and my girlfriends and the hookers at my side. Because if I tested negative, then I don't want him to feel like, oh, you know, he was actually looking forward to something. Oh, she okay. the bad news just for one yeah. So you mean to say that at point of trying- yeah, I'm trying to be tasteful. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Unprotected sex. <laughs> Raw dog. No, no. At <laughs> <laughs> point of trying, y'all knew it was ovulation period and y'all were like, this could be it. Like, you shot a huge load then, uh, yeah. so much for being tasteful. Hi, dance, mom. <laughs> <laughs> the, the point in which I shot, we knew that that was the... The Window. fertile period. Right. So y'all yeah, yeah. were trying. It was on purpose. You have a fertile period. <laughs> she has a fertile <laughs> period. Actually, guys, yeah. like, I, I don't know how to position this. Like, we were like, <laughs> in a position where we weren't desperate to <laughs> have a, We weren't in a stage where we were like desperate, like, oh, we definitely want a child or what. We were like, okay, like, let's just be out of this And since she has the apps and all, we knew that they will leave yeah. a notification mm. welcome to your fertility period, you know, oh. whatever. Oh. And then it's like, oh, and then the day that we conceived happened to be a public holiday. So like, <laughs> got all day to like, oh, yeah. but you know the exact day that you <laughs> yeah. conceived. Yeah. It was, yeah. It means the frequency not very high. You just got very, hey, no, no, guys, it, it goes down here one. You got set the bar high. <laughs> <laughs> it goes down here one. Pump up those no, numbers. No, so things that after we got married, we were still using protection. Then it was, I think only like, mm. Two two months or three months after then he's like, you know, the the unsleeve. Unsleeve. What, yeah. was it <laughs> just remove it? Was it a conversation? I be <laughs> raw now and we try? Or it's like a hey, who never buy oh, you never buy uh, no, never no, buy, no. Uh. I think from my memory it was a hey, wait a minute. Like we can have raw sex now, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And then we we actually had a very long, like yeah. okay, I would say like five to ten minute like <laughs> conversation about <laughs> it. Like before <laughs> quarters. Are we, like, yeah. are, we yeah. are we ready? And because yeah. like we've never like had raw sex during fer fertile period or so. Yeah. So we don't know. So like we basically, uh -huh. like literally in the like, oh, you horny, I horny stage, right? Then we're like, hey, we can do it raw. Then we were like, wait, wait, wait. Oh, that was your first raw? Ah. Yeah. One Damn, Damn, we Damn like, Daniel. Hey. So like literally like in the midst of that horniness, right? In the yeah. randiness. Then yeah. you look at bank statement. Look at <laughs> Dude, can we afford this? <laughs> Almost as such, we were like, wait, if really one shot kill, right? Are we ready? And then Maybe we one shot life. Yeah, one, yeah, one shot life. life. <laughs> one shot life. And then we were like, are we ready? And then we both like smile each other. We were like, actually, yeah, we Ooh. are. So then, and then okay. made the whole moment better. Yeah. yeah. Oh, the sex was great. Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> no, it was, it was. <laughs> 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 no. <laughs> the last time Pat came on, she was talking about how <laughs> no feeling. <laughs> <laughs> that one lasted damn long. Yeah, yeah, that gag was way too long. <laughs> You were saying? Oh, no, 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 it was, no, it no was great sex. It was great sex. <laughs> you were saying, you were saying no. Sex. No, okay. no, yeah, no. Okay. Don't, don't give it. Don't give it. <laughs> yeah, 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 it was great. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, but to, enough. <laughs> to answer your question, like, how I... <laughs> 
<laughs> how I found out was that I was I was actually out with friends and um she was at home uh because I think she had her own plans and so I was like drunk beyond my mind oh. when I came home. And so I was about to sleep already, right? And then she was like I have a present for you. So I thought like, because sometimes she would just randomly buy me stuff. Oh. And what she uh. didn't know was that I also bought her something. Like just the uh. other day, I was like, uh, Lazada. Your brother sucks more. Look at what you bought. So on Lazada, I just randomly bought something. I can't remember what it was. Also. Yeah. Oh, I bought her headphones. Yeah. Oh, okay. oh, oh she's not bad. Yeah. 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 So then, um, <laughs> I was like super drunk and then about to fall asleep. Then she's like, the present cannot wait. And I was like, Huh, I have to open a present now. That and must then, like, surprise all. Yeah. So then <laughs> she handed me like a, a paper bag, right? It's a diptych paper bag. A diptych paper a bag. So uh, uh, like, like this candle brand diptych, uh, like, very famous, very like, bougie, bougie. Okay, okay. So okay. I saw and I was like, oh, she got me candles. Oh, okay lah, okay lah. You kept me up for this shit. <laughs> yeah. she was, I was like, I, in my head, I know exactly what this is. Why did this like have to be in right now? So I open it, then I see there's like a lot of paper, paper, then like uh, paper, paper, then... Oh my god! Like right. I just see the three sticks, right? And where she's going to give me three Wait, negative three? tests? Yeah, yeah, that's the three just to be safe. <laughs> and <laughs> three different brands. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So the no, digital no, no. one, right? Uh, one, one of it was the digital one. The digital one is warped. Hey guys, the digital one yeah. tell you how old the baby is. Eh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. What? Is that not mad? It's crazy. Yeah. It's crazy. It is. <laughs> just two <Yeah>. days. <laughs> and then I, I don't think I'm exaggerating. You can confirm this, but I feel the description would be I leapt for joy. Yeah, he was. He was damn excited about it. Right. I was just like, I've never seen this excitement before. Not even during our wedding day, you know. <laughs> <laughs> but it's a good thing. It's a good thing. Because yeah. I thought like, you know, maybe like he would worry or just have other emotions. Mm. But I wasn't expecting that much joy. joy. Yeah. yeah. Got crying or not? Never. Surprisingly. Mm. Like even when I found out, I also didn't cry. I think right. I was just yeah. overwhelmed with like excitement. So can you yeah. ask through like how you found yeah. out and then like what was going through uh. your mind on when to tell him, etc, etc. So it happened on 14th of June. <laughs> yeah. the, the sex or the funny? Eh, no, 14th, 14th of June. No, yes, enough about that. Yeah. <laughs> 14th of July. Yeah, the conception was the 29th of June. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Conception was 29th of June. Then 14th of July, it was, I think, it was very close to my, my when my period was supposed to come ready. Then I'm just like, I'm feeling all sorts of symptoms that I could relate to when I was having my menses. But then also, like, they were very weird, like, other symptoms that I've never felt like before. Like what? Puking. Like, yeah. So I felt very nauseous. Aversion to like smells. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then like my sense of smelling heightened also. Oh, then I'm just like, wow. Is it it? Then I was like, okay lah, you know what? I'm just gonna test all. So I bought that. Sorry, bought this the- was how many weeks after conception? Two, Two weeks. weeks. Ah, yeah. yeah. So fast one ah. So the means- Fast swimmers. Two weeks, then you start to feel weird? Or throughout the two weeks already, you're feeling a bit uh, off? No, I think probably like the week before, I was already feeling so like... One week right, right. So about a week after, then you yeah. start to feel weird for about a week, mm. then you decide to test. Yeah. Yeah, but everything is like super sensitive. So like like cigarette smokes la, or like even food and yeah. like stuff right. like that. Mm-hmm. So you went to buy stronger. the pregnancy sticks mm-hmm. behind so his back, is it? I, yeah, I food panda. Oh, yeah. So I I and then I was just like, okay, what's the best like um, <laughs> What's the best like um test kit? Mm. So uh, then I'm just like Clear blue. Clear blue. Oh. <laughs> but then I bought others also just to yeah, yeah have, you know, that variation. Okay, so I bought like, I think one was a store brand and then clear blue and then the digital one as well. Then 14th of July, I tested, I think in the day because I was like, you know, I just... Just mm. do try it, one first, yeah. 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 Were you chugging water that day? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I was, I was drinking a lot of water. Because she's like, oh, I need to pee them. so much. No, because on the box, it says the most accurate testing is in the morning first piss, ma. Mm. Oh. Did you not pee? wait for it? I didn't pee, like, didn't you know, because I think uh, he was still at home. You'll never read the box on your first <laughs> 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 oh, no, you're you're you human beings are your first trip. What's raw sex? How does it work? You pee. No, so there's like a, like a, you know, litmus paper. So there's, it's at the end of the test, right? So the thing oh, of it as a stick like this, you can yeah. hold it's plastic, then there's a little bit here yeah. that's paper. They have okay. to pee on. So, so the whole thing wet and then? Yeah, law have to well, wet the whole thing. They give cap one. Cap, yeah. Cap one. Yeah, yeah, but I have to clean oh, up. If not, when you open the, the box, the then smell it. <laughs> 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 or you can pee into a cup and dip the cup. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 yeah okay, so when you like, test, then after that, like, <laughs> yeah, your no, reaction. The first test came out positive. I was like, oh my God, it's happening. I was like, okay, 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 you know what? Maybe it could be a false positive. Yeah. So I didn't want to set myself up w- for Did you that. sit there and stare at the line or I you like sh- go and live I, your I, life? I, no, I, I stared okay, at the yeah. thing. I was just like, okay, I've never experienced this before. I don't know what to do. Yeah. Um, 
I was like, yeah, it's damn weird because I never cried or so. Then I was just like, okay lah, you know what? I'm just gonna wait. Wait a while again, then I'll I'll go and test again. So I think just nice before I was heading out, I tested again. Mm. And then positive again. I'm like, uh Okay, 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 okay. Maybe now I need to do serious. a third. Yeah, maybe I need to do a shit on the thing. <laughs> <laughs> maybe I need to do a third test. So the third one was after I came back, and it was a very weird outing because after I tested positive, right? I was meeting my girlfriend for a. <laughs> for, they didn't find their relationship <laughs> <laughs> for a dinner at a bar, mm. uh, and you drank. Oh. Do you all know the gender? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Hey, what? Don't just throw that. <laughs> oh, shit. Sorry. Yeah, build the beat. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wow. So this baby is a... Stop right there. This is an important moment for you to join in. Co- comment congratulations. Comment real baby. Yeah. <laughs> Apologies for the kickback. It was not my idea. It was Shubs. It was a job well done. Back to the episode. No, I didn't oh. drink. So I had to like... Navigate uh, yeah, that. Yeah. Oh. That conversation. Oh, I'm driving. <laughs> I don't mm. have a driver's license. Oh, oh shit. Shit. smart lah. Really good. I regret getting it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I just have to navigate that that whole dinner lah. But lucky she didn't like pressure me mm. into drinking or so. Mm. I don't say this is the person I'm hearing about her finding out. Really? I realized I didn't ask. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you never do the ACR. Hey. I just assumed you just took three tests at one go. No. Why don't you know I'm just a then when you first saw when she presented you the paperback and you first saw it right did it immediately click your pregnancy or you thought oh my god you got COVID <laughs> no, no lah real lah because it's quite climate. obvious like it's, it's, it's a lot longer than a normal yeah, COVID yeah. test so like when I see the three idea right like I didn't even bother to like look up and see positive because she wouldn't give me three negatives yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? like what's the point <laughs> so like <I'm> surprised <laughs> I just saw and then like I just straight away just like hugged her and then after I go check I was like oh yeah yeah do you yeah. feel like that <laughs> meant, hey, and this one real talk okay real talk because yeah, yeah. I've, I've thought about this before okay yeah, yeah. When, when Pat and I were trying. La. And hey, I just want to say, I feel very sad for Pat because I feel like Pat just wants to know how this feels but she don't know whether she want to have a baby. Mm-hmm. And when Pat watches this, she will feel sad but she won't know why she feels sad. I love yeah. you, babe. But anyway, in my head, right, when we were trying that time, right, because I know Pat keep peeing on the thing behind our back, right, behind my back, right. <laughs> and I, I got mentally rehearsed the moment of how I should react right. mm. when Pat gave me the stick. Right. Yeah, and I like I don't want it to be a ha. Huh, you know what? Yeah. I, I I also want like for example like the way Ned says it like he let for joy. I mean you say it like she just agree. Right? <laughs> 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 I've never seen joy like that. Okay, okay. Just real quick. <laughs> 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 Sorry, I'm not bad. Wait, wait, where's the leap? part? Oh, because okay, I'm lying down already. Oh. Uh, <laughs> okay, okay, okay. <laughs> yeah. So did, did you in your head? rehearse it no not at all eh. like somehow like I was drunk so like right, that right. thing right immediately sobered me up right and I remember at that point of time um, I was something was bugging me like like something about life I think I was drunk because oh, I so stupid lah. like I was drunk because I was out karaoke with friends and I had one solo song and it was really really bad and I was eating me I was like f*** it like, up that whole thing it was the first time I hang out with that friend you're going to think I suck and all that shit so that was eating me up right and dude Ronan Keating is the way to go for you I know I, that is your someone, song if tomorrow someone never selected a, a, a Louis Cabardi song and it was it's dead ah, no, that's a strength <laughs> you gotta key down better than you gotta key down and you need to get yeah. sore throat first yeah. correct so correct so like when I when when that happened right I, I was like about to fall asleep I'm like oh, nah, what the f- why did that person do that song for me then when that moment happened right like it suddenly felt that everything else that I was worried about life, right, doesn't matter anymore. This is the most important thing right, right now for me, my wife and my child. And like, it just that was like- was then and there that night as, as you left for joy. That, that moment. Wow. Like it just, everything just escaped. I remember just feeling, I want to say emptiness, but it was like <laughs> joy and like everything else just evaporated. Falling away from it. Yeah. yeah and like, I think, I, I mentioned this maybe before in a different episode, but like, I always was a bit unsure about whether I was ready for kids. And yeah. whether I was ready for kids at this age. And at that moment, right, there was nothing that I wanted more mm. than this kid now. And suddenly I felt like I had something to lose, you know? Right. And and yeah, it was it's just such a weird feeling. How are you all not holding hands at this moment? Is this not the most sweetest moment? Because I repeated this a few <laughs> times already. Like, uh, hold hands anyway, there's cameras here. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, like I, I, I felt so ready at the moment. And then I, I tried to process it like a few days after, like why am I suddenly so ready, right? And I realized maybe one is like copium maybe, right? But like the other 
could be that it is biological that yeah. fathers uh. suddenly get this sense of duty because if not, then the survival of offspring throughout our years, like it's natural selection. Yeah. It has to happen for yeah. that to be like some form of providence and like... Yeah. You know on that note, sorry, random fact, Ken, yeah. but I don't know whether we discussed it on this show, that when when the baby come out, always look like the father for like the first month. And then it becomes like the mother. Then usually after you look like the mother. Ah. Be, because it's for the father to check the Wait, it's, do you, it's mine. Do you all know the gender? <laughs> yeah. yeah it, it's a boy. It's a boy. <laughs> hey, what? Don't just throw that. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> yeah, build the beat. Yeah. Yeah. So this baby is a... It's a boy. If you're watching this like five years in the future, like I have made it <laughs> five years, I don't think if, uh, yeah, you should not be like, go back to school. <laughs> <laughs> I have made it known that I actually wanted a girl, but I'm very happy in a way. It could be a really girly boy. <laughs> yeah. Yes. I don't mind. Stay tuned <laughs> for good. Emma. Be good. No, but some people did ask, like, hey, how come you know the gender? Because it's way too early. It's only been 14 right. weeks. And there's a way to do it. And the, the reason. Clear blue. <laughs> <laughs> I wish it was that cheap. No, so um, around the 12 week, week mark, right, you uh, are recommended to do a series of tests to see whether um, the child has Down syndrome. And you have two options. One of it is the Oscar test, which is an NT test, or the other one is the Harmony, which is NIPT. The NT test, wow, we're going to get to some educational go, go. parts, right? Okay, go. So the NT test, right, they look at physical attributes plus your, um, the, the mother's profile to see what your risk profile is like. Mm. So, for example, if the mom is above 30 or 35, then your risk goes higher and higher right. plus they measure right when they do the ultrasound the, the thickness of the neck, neck. because um, wait your neck or the baby's baby? neck the baby's oh, neck like yeah. your neck or the neck huh? bone the, 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 the neck, neck thickness neck. because um, yeah. neck is oh, children with high yeah. risk yeah. of, of Down syndrome huh? tend to oh. have um, a slightly thicker neck and they have certain measurements like longer neck lah when you I say thick but you keep doing this no, you say thick but you do this no he's measuring this like the thickness or the width yeah Oh my uh, god, my neck like, is yeah. <laughs> I mean, like, I, 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 I can't verify this with a doctor that can clarify in the comment section. But, um, so, so there's that one option uh, and it's mostly physical attributes plus the mother's profile to know the risk. And and these are all not guaranteed. Both tests will just tell you whether it's high risk yeah. or low risk or not. Mm. It feels so, so textbook and unreliable. Exactly. There is the other test that I mentioned. So NIPT. NIPT is a little bit more expensive. But what they do is that they take um, blood sample from the mother. Mm. And because the baby's DNA is already running through um, her DNA, she uh, sorry, mm. her blood, they can actually see whether the chromosomes are all okay oh, or not. Right. Yeah. And that test can also tell the gender. Because the chromosomes is... Uh, it was a thousand two. two? That's yeah. Okay. Oh. Then the other one? About 400. 400. Oh, yeah. that's a bit much oh. for oh. there, looking at the neck. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, but the risk profile is different. So the first one, I believe, is about whether they tell you it's one in a hundred chance yeah. risk, whereas this one is like one in thousands. Yeah. So it can be like one in 10,000, like whether mm. there's a low risk or not. So it's a bit yeah. more peace of mind for us. The other one is one in hundreds of thousands. No, like that's, the other one is like just one in hundreds. Right. What, what your chances are in hundreds. Yeah. And in I think when, when we were talking to the doctor about the test or so, she told us like, the chances of the Oscar test having higher false positive, uh, the f chances of false positive was higher. Oscar yeah. is the first one, the cheaper one. The first one, yeah. one the right. cheaper yeah. one. Just by a little bit, but yeah. a, lot, a lot of parents do it and it's okay to yeah. still do that. Usually yeah. the doctor will do the, the, the test first and then if the physical attributes show that maybe there's high risk, then you do it. Yeah. Right. Right. Uh, whereas right. for us, we just super kiasu and just want the piece yeah, of Yeah, of course, so I feel like that's sick money also, what? Yeah, so so we, we jumped straight to the more like comprehensive yeah. one. Yeah. And when we found out that it was low risk plus the gender, then that's when we, we made yeah. the announcement. If I'm not wrong, the, the, it's expensive because they got to send it to a lab overseas. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It, it took about two so weeks. So it's not an expensive procedure. Exactly. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, so once you found out already, then I'm guessing it's the next day, right? Then do you all, what's the next thing? Like do you tell your parents? Oh, who's the first person you like, told? Oh, yeah. We told our parents first. So... In order was his parents first and then my parents. Oh, but it wasn't immediate. So like when we had the sticks, we... Um, we, we scheduled we schedule. for a doctor appointment. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. So, so, so you all confirm, confirm then after that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we don't confirm, want confirm, to confirm, then find a doctor to confirm. Yeah, we, we don't want to like tell everybody then after that, like, I think the bad news is your disappointment yeah. will be even worse. So when uh, I think... You, you want to tell a story like you called the doctor and then they Yeah, said. so I was looking out for like gynees and I think at that point of time, I didn't know whether we wanted like Private or um, public? Private or public, like, um, gynees. But then we just went with the one that we felt was... 
I think better based on like recommendation and like mm. what other moms have also gone yeah. through. Oh, okay. yep. So in the end, we went ahead with our doctor right now, um, Dr. Chan. So At Thompson Medical. Yeah. Mm. Hello, Thompson doctor. <laughs> Is it private, public, a big price difference? Yeah, it's quite, it's quite huge. Yeah. I think and especially the give birth part is big difference. It's the yeah. delivery that's going to be yeah. the, 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 the biggest, biggest issue. Yeah. Oh, also, the gynae you're choosing is for the entire process. Yeah, so what happens what? is that if you have a private gynae, you see the same gynae all the way through. But right. if you go to somewhere like KK, which is still a really good maternity hospital. Or right? polyclinic. Yeah, mm-hmm. or polyclinic. Whenever you go for a visit, it most likely will be a different gynae every mm. time. Yeah. Mm. Okay, so okay. It, it's not a bad thing, but for us, just having that relationship with the gynae so that anytime there's any issue we call, she already knows the history of like what's happened and right. stuff like mm. that. Okay. Mm. And, and it's somewhere. not just about the different doctors. I mean, some people don't mind the different doctors because mm. they all train together. Yeah. Right? But it's more of uh, the waiting time for your turn. Mm. Right, right, right. It's like for a 20 minute uh, appointment, you wait two hours. Right. Yeah. yeah. That too. Okay. So we went for our first checkup at the fifth week of the pregnancy. So two weeks after finding out about mm. this. About there, yeah. Because yeah. that was the earliest that they could see us mm. or rather they said that anything would be feasible. Fe- eh? Too small. Too small to see if you go back earlier. Visible. Visible. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Visible on the ultrasound. Um, yeah. So I think after that we saw the doctor and then we <laughs> realised that we really like her because she was she was very straightforward. Like uh, she wouldn't like sugarcoat like oh mm, you know yeah. things are going to be merry and cherry but just like as you should know this is what's going to happen blah blah blah. If anything bad happens she's also there for us. She's the personality yeah. of mm. the, the school teacher that you thought was a little bit strict but you end oh, up loving yeah. later on. Yeah. Mrs. Okay. Schenker. <laughs> <laughs> So the ultrasound photo is the f- like how many weeks in? It was week 12. Week 12, yeah. Week 12. But what we did when we went for our first visit is that we they, they stick the tube up her. Yeah, Woo-hoo. so before the 12, <laughs> before 12 weeks. It's a probe. Yeah, it's transvaginal mm. ultrasound. After mm. that, then it's via your stomach already. Oh. Yeah. Less invasive. Mm. Right? But yeah, so with that probe, you get an ultrasound print out. And so that was when we called my parents and then we went to her parents' place. Wait, does it not poke the baby? That's what we thought. So, but apparently it doesn't. Because sex is safe. So the baby is surrounded in a water bag. Yeah, amniotic sac. Yeah. Mm. And it, it's fairly high up. High up, yeah. Before the cervix oh. and no dig unless like your <laughs> massive can like kind of penetrate okay. past that. Like. Got it. Also no problem. Please don't. <laughs> <laughs> what is here? Dude? No, but I should say right. I should say like having like intercourse, right? Like having sex after, uh-huh. after pregnancy is a damn weird thing to get your yeah, mind. Yeah, yeah. Like, I, I, I still you find out- you attractive. I really, really do. <laughs> but I cannot but- get the fact that our child is oh, yeah. just oh. swimming, swimming your shit centimeters away from where. Like, no, don't flatter yourself, like It's probably a good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but we still did. Yeah. So does okay. sex feel different when you're pregnant? I heard yes, I heard it's very heightened. Confirm or not? Please, please say something nice. It I I wouldn't say it's different, different. I think physically it feels different because I You cannot lie flat, you are like, whoa. Yeah, yeah. So apparently there are different positions, like healthy positions for when you're pregnant. Uh, so so you like, was just going in the flow, like, not knowing anything. <laughs> uh. Oh, wait, no, no. I did Google this mid coitus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We were I was literally using my phone. Okay, wait, this way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, what are the positions? I was not uh, expecting this like, conversation to be. So, like, doggy like, is one of them. <laughs> doggy is, is okay. It's okay. Because okay. the baby suspended. Yeah. Oh. But my aunt back still. And then, okay. I think, I can't remember. <laughs> You're so familiar. <laughs> You're so familiar. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like we are not going there. No. <laughs> You're all going there. <laughs> okay, so, no, but I love that we are there. <laughs> thank you. Okay, so doggy. Then. Doggy. And then one is where the woman sits on top of him, but I think reverse. So reverse cowgirl. But then there should be support for her leg. Reverse mm. cowgirl, she faced the men. She faced outside. Oh, so the reverse, reverse, the feet. Reverse, reverse, cowgirl. reverse cowgirl. No, reverse cowgirl actually faced the men, guys. No, cow, no you're cow looking at the horse. At you butt. and the horse look at the same way, right? Horse. You now are facing when you are a cowboy. Oh, is it? So cowgirl, yeah, yeah. you're facing the. I want to Google it, but I'm very scared what it turns out. <laughs> <laughs> okay, either way, either way. So the girl faced the feet, then you need to carry the leg and support. No, so you can do it on maybe like a chair or 
toilet bowl. So that her, her legs <laughs> okay. are not oh. being bent. Right, no. right. Okay, oh, let's bend the legs. Okay. Bent. Safe to say we didn't try that. Lah. Yeah, we didn't. Oh, oh, okay. No, wait. So, sorry. Reverse cowgirl is okay. Reverse cowgirl is okay. But cowgirl not okay. I don't know. It, does, it didn't, doesn't show me cowgirl. <laughs> I don't know why. Oh, you're sh- you don't follow the picture. You'll never read again. <laughs> <laughs> we meet. Maybe we if you scroll down a bit more, it says don't. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Top 10 most dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, follow the app or... Yeah. yeah. The, app the, app of, the app shows me everything. What app? What app? It's called Flow. Which oh. I think a lot, a lot. It's yeah, very a lot good. It's a new clue. It's a you pregnancy know? app. Uh, it, it, it's it changes, a period app. Yeah, it changes from period to pregnancy. So oh. you need to wear yeah. an input that you pregnant yeah. and then So you change, change oh. mode and the color. Uh. Wow, so Every fun. day they will show you like so what cool. the baby would look like and then why is it growing right now. You yeah. can now sing to your baby. The ears are now forming, that kind of thing. Right. Sing to your baby. Yeah. 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 Like, it depends on like, like the they can weight. Hear you if you sing now. Speaking <laughs> of which, right, I had friends that keep telling me, right, you should sing to the baby now because right, they will remember the tune of it. And then when later on, right, when they're five or six and super naughty, right, you sing that same tune, right? They don't know why, but they will suddenly be like super. Oh, calm. it's the neural programming thing that he oh. likes. Yeah. So were you still trying Luis Capaldi? <laughs> no, no they do a very short song. So I was yeah. trying like classical piano, like. Oh no, this, this, you can't yeah. that shit. No, no, this mean? is different. This is to like make sure the smart kid, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, so, like, yeah. Mozart, that Beethoven. was the alpha waves. Yeah. 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 Vivaldi was the, uh, the playlist uh, yesterday. They all do the three D scan where you see the baby's face and. It's Scary. Oh. I think yeah. that's like week 20. <laughs> week 20 onwards. Week, week, week yeah. 20 plus. Well, you all, you all, it's no so skin. scary. The face is crumpled and shit because it's like in your veg and stuff, right? <laughs> yeah. So it's, it doesn't look like a baby. You you look at the thing, you feel, oh my God, my baby's ugly. It's what I saw my godchildren. Yeah, it's a bit more compressed, but yeah. I, th- I think we will say, I think we're quite curious to see. Yeah. Wait, so how far along are we already? 15 tomorrow. 15, 15 weeks. weeks. 15, oh, tomorrow. Oh, by a week. Can we count by months? What would that be? Three and a half. Three no, and baby, half. up to two years old must all come by week. Oh, so. Like, like yeah, obviously you've months. had the time to kind of like understand the process quite a fair bit already. Um, what is the thing you, you are like most, I don't know, concerned with or mm. afraid of mm. with this mm. process? I think to me, it's always the constant fear, even though I don't show it, like that is my baby growing right. until like maybe yeah. like 18 or 20 weeks, then maybe oh. the baby's first movement, I can feel it. But for now, I rely on the checkups with the doctor to tell me like, okay, we can hear the heartbeat and all. So I think it's just like, you know, making sure that, okay, I'm eating right. Yeah. I'm doing things right. I'm not doing things that I shouldn't be doing. Mm. Are there a lot of life? What are the lifestyle changes and adjustments you need to make? Wow, mm. The diet stuff is crazy. Like Ooh. she cannot eat sashimi. She cannot eat like uh, un- super cooked eggs. So like any runny egg cannot. Yeah. Like, Kun cannot. Yakun cannot. cannot it has to be hard boiled egg. Yeah. Uh, Everything but has to be cooked. The sashimi one was really tough on her. So I have in solidarity said that I'm not going to eat sashimi with her. Your so. last meal. How about like yesterday? Okay. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> if it's vegetarian, even get to eh? eat. Oh, oh vegetarian. Yeah. Like the fake one. <laughs> no, but if it's raw, then cannot lah. But yeah, it's flour, it's not milk. Flour. No, because the, the problem is that if she gets like stomach flu or food poisoning, right, it's actually very mm. harmful for the oh, kid. Oh yeah, she can't even fall sick in general. She shouldn't fall sick in general. Yeah. Correct. So there's only one thing that you can still have raw. Me. <laughs> Don't go there. No, la. no, that's too much. Don't ask me just now. Dude. No, but do you know that you cannot eat ginseng as well because it thins the, the blood. blood? So oh. it's actually really bad for for pregnant women. You should have it after. So that's why alcohol also cannot lah. I mean, you mm, shouldn't even be having alcohol. Oh yeah, don't drink it. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I want to say, going back to the worry thing, right? It's mm. it's actually, like, I honestly am very, very excited and very ready and there's really nothing I want more, but there's so many stresses, right, that, like, you don't realise or you don't know and, like, every moment you want to be happy, right, there's something else. So, like, we saw the heartbeat and then, like, wow, you just want to, like, swell up and cry and then, then after the doctor tells you, okay, so the next checkup, we need to do tests for all of this. Then you're like, oh, shit, there might oh, be another like reason for this. Co- emotional rollercoaster. Yeah, and then after that, like, um, I think the first trimester was damn risky because they said like it's almost like 15 or 20% yeah. of like pregnancies during the first trimester like oh. can end up in miscarriages. So you're like, you're so excited but you never know it can just be ripped away from you. Yeah, so, so fifth week a- we had the scan. Yeah. yeah. Then after that, the following Wednesday after we did the scan, I went to a toilet and then I saw a bit of like pink discharge. Mm. Then I faster texted him. I was like, uh... Should we like just call the doctor? Then he said like, yeah, just call doctor. So I called doctor. The nurses told me to just come down immediately so that they would do a scan. And that's damn mm. scary. Yeah. So like, yeah. my sister was also a guy and I told her like, hey, like usually pink discharge is no problem. She said, no, that, that's never supposed to happen. No bleeding is good. Yeah. Both like, my sisters had though. I mean, I told you. 
Yeah. yeah. So, so like we, both both her and like our doctor said like come down immediately mm, and like yeah. So we went for a scan. Thankfully, they had a slot that day. Mm. Went down for a scan. Then they found that my womb and the uterus there was a bit of a detachment. So there were there was blood within that that hole over there. Mm. So that was what was causing the the, right. the discharge or so. The Sorry, so it's nothing to do with the pregnancy, is it? Uh, it, it, it did. So to, to, to draw, like to try and illustrate it, right? So imagine the womb mm. and then there's the water sac, right? The water mm. bed that the baby is in. The water bed needs to be stable so that the yeah. baby is stable. But yeah. the sac is supposed to be attached to your entire wall of your yeah. womb. It was detached at the top part. Oh. So it was unstable. And oh. the problem that the guy was telling us is that your womb, right? If it detects any unstable the unstability, it could just collapse in itself. And so then she had to take quite a lot of pills calm to, just, down, say, the womb. to uh. just like, yeah, calm the womb down and to stabilize it. So uh. she was taking like this pill like uh, for months. Taking like this pill called Dufaston. So it basically Dufaston. helps to increase the amount of um, progesterone so in your you body. So that you can back the uterine <laughs> yeah. lining to create anything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, then she put me on bed rest. Law. So oh, thankfully, yeah. yeah, thankfully I had like like I told my boss and then I told him that I just had to work from right. home for a time mm. being. So. That was the worrying part. Yeah. So she was like, I think after she found out, the doctor found out, right? She said, so your work is usually like um, laborers, is it? You normally walk around carry stuff. Then I was like, no, it's like, I just sit and down. Just drop. It's the way you sit up, your leg up. I don't know. Yeah, maybe so I like, run or I say not run, but walk, walk too much. Mm. But that yeah. whole week, right? I was like, what, what are you doing? She's like, she's just stretching to get a bottle. I was like, stop it. I'm getting yeah. it for you. Mm. Or like she tried to get up to like get food at that like delivery of one. She's like, what are you doing? She was so yeah, stubborn yeah. that whole week, you know. <laughs> <laughs> she just rest. So got abuse on that. I, Never. I just milk everything. Yeah, go right. Milk. Milk. Chicken rice, I like Vietnam key only. We'll <laughs> 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 next 20 minutes. <laughs> so I, I don't know if you all have done the projections or so, but what is the cost of having a child in Singapore? So most of the visits that we have are about maybe between $150 to $200 without medication. So mm. um, the visits are about once a month and then closer to the third trimester, it's about once every two weeks. So you Sorry, once a month excluding when you have to go in for like additional like emergency happen. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Yes. Yeah. yes. Okay. So so altogether that's about 1,800, 2,000 just for the visit, right? Then um, the delivery, if we decide to go private, so we haven't decided yet. What a lot of people do is that they go private for all the visits with the same doctor, then delivery, they go to like public oh. to save right. money. We haven't decided yet, but if we go private- oh, yeah. That's such a good idea. I've never heard of that. Yeah. yeah. Oh. A few people in the forums. Uh, it's most likely around 11 to 15K. For, um, and that's if you go like uh, natural is maybe about eight to ten thousand, and then C sec is about eleven to fifteen k. Right. Um, yeah, and if you do, if you, I mean, unfortunately, have to do emergency C section, then it's double the cost of a natural. <gasps> yeah, mm. but if yeah. you have maternity insurance. Emergency c is the only c that they will most likely cover or subsidize. Mm. Right. If not right. normal c they will Does the amount cover like if you need to stay in the hospital for the next few days, that kind? Uh, no, so that's separate. Because so you don't like immediately what? go home, right? There are some maternity insurance that covers your daily hospital mm. stay. Oh. Yes. Mm. Mm. So yes, yes, yes. everything in, it kind of, it totals up to about under 20k lah. Yes. Under, no, yeah. but then there's MediSafe all that that's haven't yeah. come yet. So oh, you can okay, claim okay. Through right, MediSafe right. as well. Yeah. So yeah. like visits alone, MediSafe will claim you can claim up to nine hundred. So that that two thousand to three thousand mm. that you do in visits, nine hundred is already subsidized, mm. uh, which yeah. you claim at the end. The the cash outlay in the end it will be about fifteen k natural, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So like from now until the delivery, right? Are you like what are the what are you trying to do to prepare to become a parent? Like, are there steps? Is there a course or like, what do you do? <laughs> Wait, sorry, before you answer that, when is the expected due date first? Mid-March. Okay. Which is a problem because we bought tickets for, to oh, Taylor yeah. Swift. <laughs> <laughs> then just okay, don't go It's a blessing in disguise. Yeah. There's no, a but chance. she giving birth <laughs> there? But it's seated one. Oh, it's we are so close to the EDD. Because yeah. it might be like plus minus two weeks kind. Oh. Huh? oh, you cannot plan the exact date. I, I think mean, you I think she just go. I think she just go and then you get airlifted out of it. I told him just put the hospital back in the car. Oh, you all oh, prepped okay. the hospital back. I yeah, completely yeah, yeah, understood yeah, 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 yeah. the yeah, yeah, yeah. hospital back in the car. Oh, what is there <laughs> that you need to prepare from now till the due date? Mm. You're telling what we just bought. Oh, we bought books. A b- huh? bunch of books. Like three, baby four books. books. Yeah, I think just to prep ourselves like how to work around a child because like I think for the first, like until they, they speak their first word, right? Mm. You don't know what they're crying about. So yeah. he mentioned that there was this oh. book about like the cries. The different cries and what they mean. Mm. Oh my god, it's like the different cat meows yeah. that John Paul does. Yeah, yeah. 
Yeah, mm. same. Both exactly yeah. the same thing. <laughs> yeah, so like both really... not very very unsure about the size. On. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I remember this being very useful for my sister when she first gave birth. So like, cause mm. there's different cries for like whether it's hungry, sad, like uh, uh, I don't know, just right. food, that all, all these like having enough. Wait, sleep. so how is this book telling you this sound? Oh, like they they mimic it. So there's like the mm, mm sound, for example. No, no. How's like, the book? Oh, we haven't. We it just came on you. So oh, yeah, no, your part is where, where, where. What they were, what they were actually, they were phonically, they were phonically spell it out. Uh, yeah. But I believe that there's like. But it doesn't help. Audio, audio cues, so yeah. you can like scan something and then you go. Oh. You go to YouTube. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, e means. <laughs> if I'm not mistaken, my sister's version, right? She bought it. Came with a cassette. You know, oh, that's wow. how long ago. Oh, 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 CD, CD, oh, baby. Oh, so would you? How would you rate your first trimester husband? Wow, the best. The best. <laughs> was there any particular thing that he did right that you hope all like fathers to be doing their uh, first trimester? Yeah, 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 yeah. I think just well, I feel like setting the bar very low. Like, like I mean, it's a, it's a it's a husband's job, right, to be there for your wife. But I think uh, true being present, <laughs> being present, and mm. the fact that he drove me to and fro like to the right. hospital mm. for checkups. I think. He could have just said like, you know, oh, you go I, yourself. Yeah. Which I'm I'll be okay if you are busy, lah, but I think for him he took the time out to just be there for both me and like our child. Yeah. I must say yeah. that we had I I mean for you yourself, but I have a very supportive boss who, you know, mm-hmm. allowed me to take some time <laughs> off to go for check out. At what point did John wife. find out? I told him a day after I told my parents. Wow. He was one of the early people. Oh, maybe. Because he had to go on random checkups. Yeah. Oh. yeah. So no. imagine when we all sit down here and film and then he pretend he not father that time. <laughs> then we ask him whether he want kids. Then he's like, mm, I'm open. Yeah, then are you I ready? Was like, I was like telling Pet, shut up. <laughs> it was so hard to keep a poker face that whole, you know, like. Yeah, I, I think it would have been easier for you if nobody knew. Then you just lie. But now yeah. you're thinking about what am I thinking about you lying. Exactly. I, yeah. did, I couldn't look at you. Yeah, I no, couldn't. I didn't want to look at you. No one, the people like calling you out in the, in yeah. the comments. Yeah. 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 Do you, how many kids do you plan to to have actually? Your vibe is like I mean a two. The, the last we spoke during engage encounter was one. But now. Oh. But now. Oh. He's saying like, but you haven't even. You haven't even have one yet. Like one on the way, and then now he's like two. I'm like, okay, calm down. I suddenly love kids, eh? Like, <laughs> yeah, I suddenly baby love. fever, baby fever. Yeah, I think maybe the baby, baby fever. Like, like, I was just telling her, right, I like after the, our paternity leave and maternity leave, I don't know how to like leave yeah. the child. Like, I will feel so much. No, but I'm so happy that like many guys struggle with not having their hormones kick in. Mm. So they have like the 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 female side, which like the hormones kick in already, and it's like overdrive, and the guy is like a. Just watching his wife getting fat, you know? Right, 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 right. Yeah. No, but the thing is that I feel like it's a problem also because a lot of the, the fathers that I know, like young fathers, they always say, you have to be the stability, you know, have to be a pillar of strength, you know? Your wife yeah. is going to be super worried about everything and all this. Whereas I'm like the one like, hey, I'm worried about this. Oh my God, have you heard that there's this new syndrome that might happen? There's yeah. all this and I'm like, and then she's just the calm zen one. Mm. Uh, like, so we've been- yeah, But she's always been a man, right? <laughs> no, I feel like however, whatever that I'm thinking, the baby might feel right, it also. So right. I don't want to like put like right. too much pressure. Yeah. So the baby will yeah. feel very happy today, right? Yeah. Good vibes. <laughs> yeah. Good, Good vibes. Vibes. Great vibes. Have you all um, thought of names? Yes. We have. They thought about names okay. before <laughs> they were pregnant. What they about? <laughs> oh, no, but we swap. So we we, we change. Oh, okay. We can say the first letter, then we try guess. Okay. We, Wait, no. Do people know the name? We don't care if people know or what. Oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> you don't say it like that. Uh, no, no, I mean like... <laughs> <laughs> we'll be excited. We'll be excited, but we'll be right. we are not doing like... Okay, before you even say... Okay. If it's a boy, right? Does it adhere to these principles that it is not highly unique? So people will hear this name before. Yeah. Is it less than... Like two syllabus or less? Less than three syllabus? And is it very easy to remember? Yes. Yes to... I know okay. already. Yes to one and three. Okay, okay. go. Is it, does it start with the letter E? C? No, why so many people think it starts with E? But no, because, no, no, you're because too because look Emma, like you because have a child Emma. called Ethan. Hey, Ethan, uh, my brother. But it's yeah. clearly three syllabus, guys. Which means it starts with C. <laughs> oh, shit, then. No, no but it starts with a vowel. A vowel? A. Like A. Victor? A. Victor? Ethan! Three syllables. Boy, you must have, must, <laughs> boy must have D and J to be good looking. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, girl must have A. D and J? Oh, got, got J. In the middle name. Middle. Wait, is it a boy's name? Like, it's not gender neutral kind of. Yeah, yeah, it's a boy's, yeah, it's a boy's, name. boy's name. Clearly. Oh. Oliver. Yes. 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 I, love, I love Oliver. It's a great name. 
<laughs> Oliver. I love Oliver. Oliver works from a child to grown up. You know that some names exactly. don't work from child to grown up. Like some is old person name. Yeah, like, like, like Jordan, person. it doesn't work as yeah. a child. Don't say that. Yeah. No, but it doesn't. <laughs> but Johnny. Like, William doesn't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Willy. La. Oh, so Oli la. Oli. Oli. Fantastic, fantastic. It's very y'all. It's very, it's very, yeah. Good choice. Yeah, so every time like now he talks to like the, the baby, he was like, hi Oli. What was the second choice name that didn't make Liver. it? Um, Nathaniel, because it's a combination <laughs> of yeah. Yeah. Sasha and oh. Nathaniel. Oh, you Oliver because, because of Liverpool? No, oh but God, it's a middle name no. Pooh, I will smack you. That's what I told her. Yeah, I, was like, really, like, I will smack you. I will smack you. <laughs> I don't know if really put it in. No, no. Okay, so thank you very much for watching today's very fun episode and a big congratulations to Dan and Ned. Yay! Woo! Okay, comment down below uh, if you want to see more of them. Like, oh, share, nobody <laughs> <it. laughs> No comments. So if you want to follow their pregnancy journey and their road to renovating their house, you can follow them on their socials over mm, here. TikTok also. He's a TikTok man now. Mm. Slowly, slowly. See going. you in the next episode. Bye-bye. Bye. Thanks, guys. Mm. Can we play a short fun game? Yes! So you know like baby names, right? Yeah. And then nowadays they're getting wild. Okay. I tell you all the spelling. Okay. You guess the, the pronunciation. Uh, pronunciation. Okay, ready? Yeah? Okay. okay, the first one is S S S S T. S S S Steven. Really? No. How many S's? Four. Esther. Oh, for Esther. No, no, no. Close! Close! Forest! 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 Oh my gosh! Stupid. J K M N O. J K Noel. I've seen this before. Why? Because there's no L. No L. There's no L. J K. No, this is a real person. No way! N. Then you say L. These people, right? <laughs> <laughs> you could be AC and then you could be AC or you are no B. People cannot <laughs> read, you want to do this. <laughs> K-V-I-I-I-L-I-N. Is it Roman numeral? Because V-I-I-I is... What? Six, seven, eight. 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 Okay, okay, so Kate. 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 Ah! Oh! I hate myself for getting this. <laughs> <laughs> hey, but thanks for the assist. Kate.